Hello there, Virgo. It's time for your weekly reading for March 1st through the 8th of 2021. I did make sure and post your monthly readings up on my channel. So go to the playlist that says March 2021 monthly readings and you will find your setup there. You can check out yours. You can check out, that's your, if that's your sun sign, you can check out your rising or your moon, or you can take a little sneaky peek at your sweethearts. <laughs> Call that cross watching. All right, so we're getting some volunteers already coming up. Make sure and subscribe if you're not already subscribed, if you love my vibe, because I post uh, readings for you two or three times a week. Monthlies, weeklies, uh, lunar cycles, and readings on purpose, prosperity, and love. Okie dokie. Anything else that wants to be said? I'm not coming out right away. The affirmation that I have for this Nine of Wands. Hmm. That's so I, I did this. Nine of Wands came up on the Instagram, I believe, on the Instagram reading. It also came up in another reading somewhere else. One of the other signs. I can't remember which one. But it was it was all about feeling like other people are trying to tell you what to do right now it might not be the case that other people are telling you what to do though i'm like i'm getting this like really there it's it's i'm getting this vibe of maybe it's like a pouty kid that was told no right a pouty child that was told no 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 you can't do that and the child is just like i'll do what i want to do <laughs> right take a good look at his face he's like can't tell me what to do right and he's like he's holding his his wands and he's just like everybody's always trying to tell me what to do and he like turns his back and he's just like i'm gonna do whatever i want to do anyway but and he just like goes out and does it in kind of a sneaky way but also kind of a um defiant kind of manner so is that something that, that you resonate with virgo i can do that sometimes i can be a little bit i can be a little bit sassy like when you can't tell me what to do but i just i don't want to make a big scene a big dramatic scene about it and so i just go get what i want anyway in my own way and then uh that the eight of pentacles also wanted to come out this is not um i'm sorry this is very much a virgo energy very much a, like just plugging away at my work just plugging away at my work okay so so the two affirmations that i have it's like two different things that i want to that i have wanted to present themselves to you for this week and one, the first one being the nine of wands and the affirmation that I have for that would be, if I want it, I can go have it, okay? I don't have to be sneaky about it. I don't have to be defiant about it. Just because somebody else, I'm a grown ass woman, right? Just because somebody else tells me I shouldn't do that, doesn't mean that they, it doesn't mean anything. <laughs> I can do what I wanna do as long as I'm not hurting anybody else, as long as I've earned it for myself, right? So just do it don't don't take on that resentful defiant energy because that just it just drags it drags negative energy toward you so be happy and be grateful that you can have whatever you want because look at this you earned it you, your self-discipline your attention to detail your excellent planning skills and your and your drive your self-discipline to show up day after day after day and accumulate the resources that you have have put you in a position so that you can have whatever you want. So don't feel bad for a second about it. Don't let anybody tell you you don't deserve it. Especially those little voices in your head. <laughs> All right, Virgo, you're going to have a wonderful week. I will see you for sure next week. And if you're subscribed, you will get some more readings during the week as well. Make sure and check out that monthly reading. I love you, Virgo, and I will see you.